Chris, I know you are familiar with the concept of a of a B movie, right? Like a like oh, a oh yes, yeah, like a tra- <laughs> like a trauma or a, you know, so one of those. It's like ah, uh, this is cheesy and it's kind of shitty and it doesn't look super great, but it's got this like undeniable weird charm to it, and I'm just super sure. into it. Yeah, sure, yeah, okay. lots of them. I, I, my library is lousy with those movies. All right, well, are you aware of the fact that also games do this? <laughs> I. Uh, had a strong suspicion. Sure. Yep. Because so this is this is from the legendary DP series. This being DP two. Yes. Um, DP two. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yep. I, I I prefer DB seven. Your mother, your sister, and your aunt. That's like one of my favorites. <laughs> but that would be DP six technically. But welcome back to the dojo, right. everybody. I'm Jeff. I'm Chris. I have a dirty mind, and I apologize in advance. <laughs> um. So Chris. Deadly Premonition is a game by this weird Japanese game developer called Swery, and it is a super culty uh, hit about this like FBI agent who goes to this small town, kind of Twin Peaksy, and it's just really strange. There's like some Resident Evil stuff, but then there's also a lot of like weird driving around, trying to interview people and talking to himself. Grant and I once upon a time tried to play it because the people that love Deadly Premonition really like it, and we literally stopped because neither of us could stand it. So, <laughs> wow. Uh, yeah, yeah. So I'm, I'm here to give Deadly Premonition 2 a chance, but I'm going to warn everybody that I, I'm, I didn't come here to make friends. I came here to win, God damn it. <laughs> also, I hear that the frame rate in this game is like in the single digits, and it sucks. So uh, 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 I know how you are about frame rates, sir. Yeah, and and nope. it is not forgiving against B movie frame rate levels. Well, well, I don't know if you need the subtitles and the gigantic words game. <laughs> uh oh, oh. So this town is is John Lacar? What? Yeah, it's a it's like a fictional Louisiana bayou swamp HBO from five years ago town. I think. I mean, when you're less than 30 seconds of the game and it's already tipping its hat to probably superior mystery, then that's never a good sign. <laughs> I don't know. All I know is that taking a lot of pictures of a lot of things. Oh, oh, that's very uh, important. You're going to want that. Uh, oh, come on. You cut it off right at the best part. My Murdercation 2020. Uh oh. Whoa, Mr. Freeze and Victor Zaz joined forces. <laughs> wow, Good I like Lord. it. Good Lord. All right. So, all right. So there's no prem. There's nothing before this that says what's happening, right? This is it? I mean, I think there's some nods to the previous game, but no, we are at minute one. We just hit new okay. game. Um, they found Kelly Clarkson's secret murder ice warehouse. <laughs> Wait, why is it Kelly Clarkson? All the uh, all of the boxes said Clarkson on the side. Eighty eight uh, hours later, that's a very strange number uh, Nazi, of hours. <laughs> Nazi hours later. God damn it! God damn it! Oh, okay. Oh, hello, Simon. Oh, foreshadowing. You're on the clock. Oh. Quiet down. Oh. Oh wait, I can. Oh. Any idea? Oh, you can okay. move. Are you moving that? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah naked in Havana right now. Um, so what is your opinion of this frame rate, Jeffrey? <laughs> Not great. <laughs> okay. A mojito and a fish pizza, huh? Uh, okay, so first off, you guys got to stop with your fish pizzas. I mean, seriously, I'm not even kidding. We'll call the law if we have to. We don't want to have to have come to that, but that's just wrong. Rob me of my well-deserved vacation. Okay. Pizza? I'll buy you some pizza. You can find that junk anywhere. Also, it's Whoa. worth noting, Chris, hey. that um, when it said that I could walk around, no matter what direction I pressed, pizza it always junk. went in the same direction. Like what? there was no really? actual control. Yeah. <laughs> oh my That's god. That's weird. God. So you just press the go button, basically. Go, go for do the thing that you're gonna do regardless. How? How long do I have to listen to this guy talk about here? I guess can I just open the door? I don't. Oh, oh, uh, what? oh, boy. We make an out. When did this game come out? Today. <laughs> You're joking, right? No, no. It came out today. This is a brand new Switch game, a fifty or sixty dollars Switch game that came out this Friday, July. Uh, 
10th. Uh, I was going to say 1990. Year of Our Lord, 2020. <laughs> um, Isn't this one of the after, like alone in the dark games? I don't know. Uh, wait, why did he take off his tie? Uh, uh-huh. to- <laughs> oh, it's Francis Zach Morgan. So he's the protagonist oh, from the. Yeah. He's he's the protagonist from the first game. So okay. All right. So who, this ties into that, or do you think maybe you become him at some point? Because we're gonna like, be. Yeah, yeah. I, I've seen the trailers. We're gonna play as him. Like okay, he's, he's the say, protagonist. Yeah. Because nobody wants to play as a character who thinks pizza is junk. You're like, yeah. okay. First off, you no one likes you. Uh, uh, so it's funny because the guy that wait, that's not Francis York Morgan. That's some old gray haired guy with a mustache. Mustache. What, what is going on here? Maybe he's uh, much older now. Maybe this is takes place years after the events of the game. Oh, he's smoking transparent joints. Is that? He's reading the classic Rat Man. <laughs> uh, oh, he's watching Rat Man on DVD. He's got the whole series. Uh, uh, Rat Man sports. one through seventeen. <laughs> oh, is that okay? The Royal Us. That's why you're here. Oh, bonk. Uh. <laughs> Ah, okay, all right. <laughs> so the, serious now. The funniest thing about this developer, Chris, is that like this is his most famous game, I feel like, and I like everything else he's made, but I did not like Deadly Premonition. He made a game well, called D4 Dark Dreams Don't Die that was really strange and interesting, but uh, it wasn't like boring to just drive around and exist. It wasn't like an open world game. It was just a weird game. And they made another game called The Disappearance of J.K. Macfield or something like that. That was like a side scroller where the main character was immortal and you would solve puzzles by breaking her body apart and then like going through places and then like regenerating. I don't know. It was very strange. Okay. That is very strange. Well, so far this, I mean, there's no way of knowing where this thing is going at this point, but you, from what it sounds like, from what you told me, this is more conventional B detective slash R. Anything you say used against you in a court of law. Please keep that in mind as you speak. (laughs) Where is she from? (laughs) Yeah, Uh, (laughs) it's definitely (laughs) supposed to be Bayou, but I don't know. I don't. I don't know what the fuck is going on here. I don't. Eh. I gotta get eh. back to drinking beer and taking pills. Apparently, I've only gotten through Ratman Seven. I can't wait to see what happens next. Something wrong, Mister Morgan? Uh, there seems to be a lot wrong with Mister Morgan. I'm FBI Special Agent Aaliyah Davis, and this is Simon Jones, <laughs> an analyst. <laughs> My old friend Simon Jones. Us for years now. This How is... dare you, sir? Uh, hi. Simon, take the camera out of my bathroom, please. <laughs> I'm tired of knowing that you see me poop. <laughs> yep, or she agrees with you. A southern belle and a lonesome loser who can't catch a break. Uh uh huh. Oh, okay. He'd be the perfect oh, that's I, that. See, that's meta. We should be laughing now. Jeff, Jeff, what? let's laugh. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> that's ironic because we're playing a video <laughs> game. Do you think he knows? I, I, I don't know. It's entirely possible this game oh, might end with Francis Morgan realizing that he's in a video game or something. I, no one was I mean, going to. I mean, Metal Gear Solid did it for games, game after game, and everybody loved it. It's a little, a little bit, sort of, a little bit. Uh, <laughs> not Jeff. Jeff not, didn't love it. He'd just like to say that. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm saying that it didn't do that entirely. It never was like, this is a video game. Um, it was more bizarre than that. Oh, okay. So now we can like actually like look at stuff, messy awards and trophies. Look at them. Appreciation from the governor. And the Department of Justice. Straighten your frames, Francis. You're in the FBI, yeah, goddammit. Come on, have some self-respect. Okay. Um, look at his poker face. His pup 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 poker hey, face. Pup pup poker face. <laughs> Stop staring at my poker face. Why are you dressed so handsomely? <laughs> I'm, I'm wearing pants. That? Like what? What? 
This was clearly written by a non-English, not first language speaker, is what, what I'm saying. Oh, I know. I see. The thing is that you 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 say that, but like, I think this is all intentional because I've seen other games of his that are that that are not like this, right? So, confidence. You think they're trying doing trying to sound like they don't? English isn't their first language. Decision. I don't know. Symbolizes your declaration of war against a predominantly male. Why would you? I don't even understand. Oh. Is that what that means? This I, guy is an incel if I've ever heard one. That's why I wear a female necktie to declare my war against a predominantly... <laughs> <laughs> what? <sighs> it's a psychological barrier. Maybe she, like, you know, was staying over at her dude's place and then just grabbed a tie because all ties are the same, Francis. Why would she, gra why would she grab a tie from her dude's place? I don't know. Maybe she what, what? spilled she fucking... And what if she grabbed a tie from her girlfriend's place? Or a girlfriend? Well, yeah, sure. I don't care either way. It doesn't matter to me. I just we've spent twenty minutes focusing on this tie. How long have we been recording? I feel like I know, it's been the an guy hour like have. glanced at an issue of psychology today and was like, "I got a great idea for some dialogue here." Blink. Okay. God damn it. <laughs> She doesn't move her head at all. She blinks like a cartoon. Okay. I just can't get past the weird sort of like uh, like a, three consoles ago skin textures. Yeah. They also do that thing that a lot of Japanese developers do where when they animate from one pose to another, there's no wind up and no easing on it. So it just like looks really super robot. Did all that smoke and kill all your little gray cells. Oh, shit. Francis, break out the weed! Oh, wait, yeah, okay, that's right. first off, marijuana does that's not kill not. brain cells, so I just want to say. <laughs> I thought you were with the FBI, not the DEA, Alia. She's Way smart, to be a narc. She's also more she she didn't like pizza, so you kind of saw it coming. <laughs> Simon just called her a shrew? Right in what, front of her. What? Right what, in front of her. What year is it, Simon? <laughs> Agent Jones. It's going to be your harassment. job to tame wait. her. Is it is it sexual harassment to call a woman a shrew, or is it just... I don't even know anymore. It's better just to go, yes, it is, and it, don't do it. <laughs> okay. I don't know, Jeff. No one tells me the rules anymore. I just try and keep my mouth shut. Yeah, me too. I just... I'm... Does that barrier of yours also protect you from violent criminals? I feel like I'm watching, um, like, a really really bad episode of Sherlock or like one of those Amazon movies that are just filmed on like a, a phone that they put on Amazon. Okay. Okay. Can't read him. Wait, did I say that out loud? Am I talking too much? I'm gonna <laughs> Okay. Using the files on the table to shake him up. All right, shake it up. Uh, what? What can I? I can, can I look? Wait, hold on. Go look at the files no, on the I'm, table. I'm trying, but I would rather. Okay, look into his vacant eyes. Oh, he's got a tumor. Well, that's can tell just by looking at his eyes. I think he. They've got a file on him because he used to be an FBI agent. Mm, okay. Um, but like. How do humans behave? Death is just around the he also doesn't seem like he's got a tumor. He seems like he's turning into an X Man or something. Like, <laughs> yeah, he has got a legion ishness about him. Yeah, he's like, I'm okay. Uh, the Le Carre case files. Do you remember the homicides that took place in Le Carre, Louisiana, in 2005? No. Yes. Maybe. Yes, I've watched all the movies about them, the Ratman cases. I'm addicted to that series. Uh, uh-huh. Coincidence, you encountered a serious incident in a town you visited while on vacation. Okay. You decided to steal the right to So is this what happened in the last game, I assume? No, this is this game. I mean... No, 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 I mean, because you said he was the protagonist from the last game. Yeah, but this is they're setting up like a thing where we're going to flashback and then play the um, flashback. I see. Kind of like okay. per Persona 5 kind of sure, framing device. Sure, sure, sure. Yep, yep, yep. I get it. I'm all caught up now, Jeff. There you go. 
just as you said. And I think if I remember from the previous game that Francis, like, he, he talks to, like, this imaginary partner that he has that he just talks to all the time. Um, you were okay. 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 Immediately after that, didn't you? Just can't seem to keep ourselves away from dead girls. <laughs> well, that's not a good sign. That's don't you know? I mean, don't tell people that at the very least. That's what I put on my Tinder profile. I don't know why I can't get any dates, Chris. Just can't <laughs> seem to stay away from dead girls. That's what is it? Everyone I seem to have interest in turns up dead. I mean, <laughs> the only connecting factor is. Oh uh, shit! I gotta get out of here. Then <laughs> we suggest you read it, Bell. Bell. Either okay. way, that case is closed. Closed. <laughs> you sure about that? Yes. Well, you, you could just show us. Is still missing some crucial pieces. Uh, wait. Why did the music Come stop? On. No need to beat around <laughs> the bush with us. Because that was a dramatic moment. Chris, what do you think is he had on his coffee table? It's where that big triangle is. I think he had a triangle. <laughs> just, a, <laughs> just a piece of construction paper cut into a triangle? Uh, yep. Oh, yep. Um, uh, why is whoa. there a oh, case of Clarkson milk? <laughs> oh. Hidden deep within the Clarkson Food Delivery Services cold storage warehouse. Uh huh. Oh, After okay. After 14 years, we finally discovered the body of the very first victim. Wait, did this just happen? Do you know what this means? Yes. No? That's why we're here. I don't know. Because the case is not cold anymore? First sure it's ah. cold to me. Uh, I don't even know how to play this game, Chris. This, this is, is too confusing. Like now. <laughs> no, no. Like Keep going, Jeff. You'll yeah, figure it out. This is like trying to do an MST3K to that episode of Twin Peaks with the nuclear bomb. Uh, <laughs> you're just like, what? What? No, no. Sooner or later, we'll get back to the flashback, and then you'll actually get to move around on your own and look at shit and what have you. I don't know if I want to. This frame rate sucks. <laughs> uh, don't be a snob, Jeff. Well, you there's snobbiness, and then there's like you minimum play acceptable You play retro games that are like 20 years old, so Aren't come on. Those have a good guys? frame rate. <laughs> All right, that's fair. That case. Lisa's body can't change anything now. Okay. And it certainly has nothing to do with us. Okay. I suspect the body was stored there rather than abandoned. Why are those in quotes? Due to the unnatural state it was found in. <laughs> yeah, if they're quotes and dialogue, shouldn't she actually be making air quotes? I mean, how else would you know that there were quotes there? I'm pretty sure this game had a budget of like $400, so we're lucky there are graphics in this game. Uh, it's like somebody's 13-year-old nephew did the animations. Why are those italicized? Come on! It doesn't make sense. Well. Well, I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you. I'll say <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? Uh, it seems stranger. She's so pretty. Man, I just can't get over how fucking hot that girl that's been cut to like 12 pieces and frozen just in a block of ice is. Something about the way her head is cut off for the rest of her body. I was just like, damn, girl. Mm. I'm going to take the, the opening cutscene of this and like put romantic comedy trailer music behind it. Piece of or a mythological figure. Well, she gives good head, but that's it. Ah, boo. <laughs> Somebody was going to make better, that joke. Better. And by that, I meant you were building up towards it. Isn't that right, my fairy? Who? A corpse what? as beautiful as a ghost. Who's he talking to now? His imaginary partner guy, or maybe Just not. I don't know. A... Huh. Huh. Well, uh, okay. Can we, that like... Now I'm sure <laughs> no. hiding something. I'm glad she knows what's going on. We'll I'm able to get what I want if we go deeper thoroughly into lost. Uh, <laughs> I I think I have a good idea what's happening here. Good, you can explain it to me later. Uh, it's all about oh. the triangle, Jeff. Hold the oh, what the fuck is this? What the hell vision? <laughs> um, I held down the. Okay. Did you not look into the instructions before you started playing this game? 
It's a digital game. There's no instructions. I can't go anywhere, Chris. <laughs> well, you can go to the options menu and go, That's here's what the commands cool. are. Uh, no, the options menu for this game uh, really you sucks. Oh, all right. Right. They were banned by the Sites Treaty. Oh, my God. Okay. That was made in France <laughs> in the 1900s. Uh, Man, Jeff, you really hate this game. It just seems like not a lot worse than most of the other shit you make me watch you play. But <laughs> I, I just it feels so good in our hands. I I I I'm too old for this shit. <laughs> um, you're the perfect age for this, Jeff. It's a hard game to enjoy when you're all by yourself. And you're probably being punished for something you did. Look at that. There's a whole carton of crate of milk behind him taped together. Why is that there? I don't I have no idea. I may not look it, but I'm actually a bit of a chestnut myself. Simon, no one cares. Stop talking. School, I used to pour over every issue of Chess Life. Oh Chess? my God! Why are you still talking? Well, unfortunately, your guess is completely wrong, Agent Jones. What? Shut the fuck up! Game, nor is he solving workbook problems. Wouldn't he know that if he was a chess nerd who read Chess Life in high school all the time? <laughs> there isn't a single chess book to be found in this apartment. And what does that mean? Maybe he's uh, maybe he just likes playing chess and doesn't do research on it. Is his password hello exclamation <laughs> point? Yeah. When did she get a chance to check his internet history? <laughs> I don't know. Well, alternately, maybe someone came over and played chess with him, and so, neither one of them are like, you know, super uber uber chess fanatics. I've bad. been known to play chess, I and I don't own a single book about chess. How oh no, I must be lying. Seriously <laughs> I don't, uh, people do that shit all the time. I've done that shit. You can play yeah. both sides of a chess game. This was clearly in the days before uh, video games that were better than this, so... <laughs> Much bigger problem. <laughs> this is Shenmu three all no, over no. again. I don't even know. Legal manner. We simply happened to intercept a handful of data being sent out from an unknown origin. I thought you said you checked his entire internet history. Ooh, now she's <laughs> also, I think the Barry in the lead here that literally everything in this house is covered with a thin layer of serious. cocaine. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Also, he's like smoking and just straight up smoking a joint in front of you. Uh, yep. You can use visions to acquire there important hints. Use vision. Using a vision will deplete your concentration. Be careful about using it too much. So that's what I did. I held down the button and it did this, right? Um, and then like I I tried to look, but like there's nowhere to look. Do I look at the photo? I think you've just gotten as much as you can get out of your vision in this scene. Okay, so can what you do look I at the photo without the vision there? Yeah, so just look at the photo he didn't regular. Just so twitch when he saw he's even tougher than the rumors made him out to be. But I was prepared for that. Oh, what a man. Right, he's deeply intertwined with this case. All okay. right. Deeper than what my students <laughs> think. All right. And what is the triangle? <laughs> I I uh you can okay. do it, Jeff. Do I do I do this? I don't even know what I'm supposed to do at this point. Like I, I already think he's the... waiting for the text to keep going forward. It's like a choose your own adventure where you only get to actually make a choice once every 17 pages. <laughs> okay. Patricia Clarkson. You look surprised. I thought you already knew. After all, you visited Louisiana last week. Was it last week? We assumed you met with. He looks like he hasn't gotten out of that chair in more than a month. Yeah, it looks like John Doe has had him tied to that chair for a full year. <laughs> we haven't been. To I see what you did there. Yeah. Not in fourteen years. Okay. Flashback, flashback, flashback already. Come on, flashback. We don't care. Simon might say something again if you don't flashback. Aren't you, Simon? He's right. He just sits here and does cocaine and jerks it. He didn't even take a single <laughs> step outside on Christmas Eve. Just jerked it, drank milk, and snorted a bunch of blow. That, that dude drinks milk and snorts cocaine like you would not Are believe. You positive about that? He's kind of a all white stuff of type of guy. <laughs> oh. Last Friday, the name Billy Bishop was listed on a morning flight out of Boston. Okay. This is the fake name you used to use as an agent, isn't it? I. <laughs> A mere coincidence. 
Oh my god, I fucking hate this game already. You love it. It's not all. Have a facial expression. Move something besides their mouth's game. I know, no I'm same. fully invested. I need to know what the happened. A large scar on his forehead. So many people ba have badgered me for years to go back and play the first one of these. And I was like, all right, the second one's coming out. I played some more of this guy's games. I'm willing to give it a chance. He reported the oh, same oh. Oh. big and strong. <laughs> So I presume those other games have a very different playing style, then? Yes. They're good. Our world well, that's not what I asked. <laughs> D4 Dark Dreams Don't Die gets into the action right away, and it's crazy. And the, the most JJ Macintosh or whatever game is like a side-scroller, and it's fun. Um, what is he smoking? He's not even smoking. It's is he smoking? He didn't move his hand. They couldn't be bothered to animate him putting the <laughs> cigarette in his mouth. What? Incidentally, well, because they were like, well, look, it's going to say he's smoking, so they'll get the idea. There is a way to do this scene, Chris, where you don't have to animate them if you don't have any money to do Trenton, it. You just, you know, put the stuff at the bottom and then you have them pop up like JRPG guys on the left and right. Type of car anywhere. And I wouldn't expect them to move, but you've, you're rotating this camera around all, like, moody and shit. Isn't that right? My yeah, God. let us go through the text like you do on a JRPG, where you just got to, look, I can read fast, okay? Circle, 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 circle. Well, I mean, I'm, <laughs> I'm, con I'm controlling what text comes up when. Every time they go to a new line of text, that's you me hitting the button, so. Fair enough, because when I play these games, I'm like, yep, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. <laughs> You love it, the Jeff. This is the best game you have ever played. We did the best we could and you know it. You just don't want to admit it. There wasn't much we could actually You're scared the by the evident genius in this that it's going to upset just the very way you think about playing games. All right, sorry about that. It's a brief technical issue. We missed we missed a few seconds worth of story. but uh, Or who knows? I don't know. Maybe he was talking so slowly that, you know, the, we, we didn't miss anything. Uh... <laughs> This reminds me of a rose I smelled once long ago. <laughs> Are we going to flash back? Are we going to flash back? I'm having a flashback right now, just staring at the screen that nothing is happening on. <laughs> Go. Do a thing. It's been almost a half hour. Come on, video game. Uh... This game is actually trying to kill you. Uh, no need to answer. I want my money back, Chris. You did you pay for this? Oh, fuck yeah, I paid for this. Sure I paid for everything. How much did you pay for this? Like 60 bucks. 60 bucks? Are you fucking kidding me? No, 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 no. They put out a whole... All you're doing is encouraging him. You know what? If people wanted you to play this shit so bad, they should have paid for you to play it. Uh, well, they do. It's patreon.com forward slash rage select. Oh, so. Fair enough. Fair enough. Okay. Okay. Oh, now we can look at the strangely tidy spots. Another strangely Mr. clean Morgan. spot. The triangle. What about the fucking triangle, yeah, Mr. Morgan? Tell me about Explain. the triangle. Explain that shit. Through. Look at that. Strange. Look at that. Clean. Did you tidy up a bit because you knew we were coming? Did you hide your triangle-shaped cocaine mirror? <laughs> <laughs> but then the whole place is covered in cocaine? Those are it's my new sanctuary. experimental frisbee. It keeps stabbing God. people, so it's not really working out. Sanctuary. You know, for kids. Uh, sacred places, uh -huh. hovels for pure souls. Hovels for pure souls. Hovels for pure souls. Okay. Uh, what, what kind of question is that? Souls still there. I want to just. I want them to slap them upside the head. And be like, do you have a lamp or a vase or a plate? What was sitting on your table? And how big is your forehead? Are you the arch enemy to the Hulk? Yeah. Seriously. <laughs> Are you the leader? Hey, Simon. What? Don't touch the sanctuary. Why? What is the sanctuary? Did I the, miss something? Sorry. The clean spots are the sanctuary. Hovels for pure souls. Uh, yes, sanctuary. oh, of course. That no, all makes sense now. No, Never it doesn't. It again. You've been watching us for four and a half years. Uh, you 
couldn't even figure that much Look, out. I've played JRPGs that were not <laughs> intended bad. for American audiences that, uh, on any level that made much more inside, sense you know. than this. Far more than you deserve. You know, I'm curious because I know that, I mean, you've been seeing this, right? So, oh, yeah. How would you rate this, uh, like on a, on just like a watching a movie level of like a, was your specialty, an intentionally strange movie, a David Lynch movie type of thing? It fails. Uh, and why does it fail? Because, for one thing, well, I mean, if you're going to talk, what they're doing with the camera or movements, forget about it. This thing is just point. Like, I mean, it's it's way too static for there to be any consideration to be taken seriously on that level. In terms of dialogue, it just like is someone who has seen a lot of this stuff, but has just very limited intelligence, or at least in or context for the English language, because nobody talks like this. Nobody responds to things or asks each other questions like this. Yeah, it's just you know, no, it it doesn't follow. You're like, who, who communicates in this way? Um, rummaging Simon. That's the only thing I could take. Okay, well, okay. I mean, stop okay. rummaging. So, so here's so here's something that I would say is that I feel like this would have a different tone. I, all, all honesty, I feel like this would have a very different tone if they had facial expressions. Nobody has any facial expressions. They all have the same facial expression. And so there's no like Do you recognize these the, the 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 dialogue is is just like Whoa, whoa. Oh, he touched the sanctuary. Oh shit. Oh shit, it's on now. Oh something happened, Chris. Ow. Oh my god. Oh my god. Did it or is he sanctuary. just helping him? I don't know. Let him go. Or, Assaulting an FBI agent is an obstruction of you. justice. What happened to her finger? Go, ah, stay back, stay back, sanctuary, die. Okay, what? I, if this should have happened in the first two minutes, like. Ah, ah, <laughs> I, I like this. I like this part. I like this. See, this I like. Something's actually happening. He's talking. He's saying things that aren't even what he's saying in the subtitles. Yeah, he's just. <laughs> ah, ah. He sounds like a drunk Arnold Schwarzenegger. I cut my finger with that can opener this morning. I thought I stopped the bleeding. But oh, yeah. Better it. explain what that is. How could I be so stupid? How did she cut her back of her finger with a can opener? What possible maneuver could you have done with a can opener Everything to cut the be fine now. back of your finger? Oh, it's so the can opening equivalent of writing this dialogue. Sure it's incompetent the and backwards. The color red. Uh huh. Such an unusual thing to fear. How does he go outside ever? Please accept my deepest apologies. What? I, I'm sorry too, Morgan. I don't know what I was thinking. Uh, uh, sorry that I, I literally touched fell and accidentally touched your crazy ever. zone. <laughs> no more red either. <laughs> um, Isn't that couch kind of red? I mean, it's uh, his couch. Uh, 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 question mark? I don't know. Apparently, pink is okay. He's got like four pink DVDs behind him. So there you go. Something actually happened, Jeff. That's what you got. What you want? Now we're pretty much back to where we were before. No. Let's ask him some Maybe more questions about random shit in the room. Hey, what's that beer can on the floor? Is that a brand of beer that you like? Don't worry about the beer. The beer is from another time. <laughs> what? That fear is connected to the Greenville case. Uh, all right, Jeff. Yeah. I feel like you've done your due diligence on playing this game. No, Chris, we're we're like getting there. We're we're going to wrap this one up after this dialogue, but we're not stopping until we get to that fucking town. So, are you sure that there is an end to this dialogue? I know there's an end to this dialogue. I've seen it. I've seen it on the internet. <laughs> okay. Um, maybe those are post-credit scenes. I stepped in to take over the case. Okay. I also remember it becoming a sprawled investigation due to evidence found in the victim's throat. Oh, like Silence of the Lambs, huh? Is that correct? <laughs> Are you referring to Silence of the Lambs? Is this in the Silence of the Lambs universe? The Lamaverse? The Slamaverse? Yeah. Slams? Two years. 
And when you returned, you requested to be switched over to desk work. <laughs> what? He obviously what knows all this. What is the point of telling him? That's a private matter. I, I still don't know why they're questioning None of your business, Bill. Him. Were you traumatized? Hmm. Hmm? It's a common problem with prolific yeah. agents, but there's another possibility that this is make more a very sense. odd course of questioning, considering it's like, so you were involved in a case you that we just found a victim from some decades after it happened. So I'm going to ask you about the color red. <laughs> uh, well, and then she was like, what are you getting? She was really concerned with like the fact that he was like controlling the conversation. Thinking too much um, about something will always turn it into a problem. The Greenvale case. Um. Don't you think it resembles <laughs> the Luke Carre case? Um. Read the report. We have nothing else to say. Um. No. Okay. Um, well, I. Just I need one more push. Okay. You know what? It's, you're going to yeah. have to come back tomorrow to see that push because we're what? out of time. Yes. Oh, no. Yes. We're coming back and playing more of this? We are. We are going to get there, Chris. So, oh, you're a monster. Uh, if I had known. <laughs> if I had known, Jeff. Um, yes. Yeah, so, hey, everybody. Hit the like and subscribe button or hit the down vote and unsubscribe from Rage Select. I wouldn't blame you. I wouldn't blame you at all. <laughs> um, if you'd like to help us out, if you're still here and you like to just see the pain, hear the pain noises, patreon.com forward slash Rage Select is where you can go to help us out by giving us the money that we need to buy the $60 games to then make the pain noises over and say that your favorite game sucks. Like, that's what we're doing here. We're trying to tear down everything you love patreon.com forward slash rage select um or you know we're just playing a video game and, and and having a good time you know uh either way amazon links also are down below you can use those to buy this game if you want or maybe the original i'm not sure what i'm going to put down there yet but you can use to buy whatever you want you can also use them to buy anything off of amazon and we get a little bit of money for that uh chris when you are not helping me to retain my sanity in deadly premonition 2 where can the people of the internet find you I'm on oneofus.net, where I promise we will never, ever make you sit through this game. <laughs> That's a promise that I just can't make. 